Hello, gentles and lady men. I'm Ulan Gaming, and today I have a game from my uh, 1v1 practice matches that I was doing against randoms in preparation for my match against Gideon AI in the tournament. Uh, in this game, I was practicing my India Fast Industrial, and it happened to be against USA, which was a, a bit of a lucky for, for, foreshadowing into what happened in the tournament where the final match turned out to be my India Fast Industrial versus USA. Granted, it was a very different USA strategy compared to uh, this one here, but it was still fun. And uh, this, this one shows off the India Fast Industrial strategy quite a bit, and I enjoy that strategy quite a lot, so enjoy the video. Adesh, Sai. Uh, the India Fast Industrial. What a fun strat. Huh? Sai. Mekarunga. Adesh? Sai. Um, I should have an eighth settler on, on wood. Where's my eighth settler? Or maybe it's seven. Yeah, I think it is seven. Daya Mekaru. Here we go. That is quite the deck. <laughs> huh? Sai. Sai. Mekarunga. Sai. Mekarunga. Huh? Sai. Ade. Food treasure here. Mekarunga. Tayar. Hamla. Ade. Hamla. Sai. Hamla, Hamla, huh? Adish, Sahi. Huh? Huh? Hello. Taya. All right, so far so good. Huh? Let's check out his deck. Going for a fast fortress type play style. Tayar, Sai. Yeah, she got it. Shit. Yeah, just kill all the animals, why don't ya? And hurt them badly. Even better. Although I suppose the moose don't really hurt. Alright, so we're doing an in-base aggro. I'll put it right here where it'll be probably the most annoying. And we're getting a market up, putting two people on coin, putting more people on wood. We're gonna get hunting eagles, followed by blanket filters and civil servants. Yeah, huh? Sai. 
मैं करूंगा साई हमला हाँ साई हम इन्हें क्या एक्सप्लोर इस बेस कमाने वाला आदेश मैं करूंगा कमाने वाला आई नेक्स्ट वी वांट 1 2 3 4 एंड देन 5 वंस वी गेट द रिसोर्सेस या शिकार है हेलो शिकार है वी वांट द वुड ट्रिकल मैं करूंगा आदेश ओह ही स्टक ऑल द सेलर्स इन देयर टू ट्राई टू किल माय एक्सप्लोरर्स साइड ओके मैं करूंगा आदेश में जा शिकार है शिकार है हेलो आदेश मकान बन कंसोल एंड स्टार्ट सेविंग अप फॉर प्रोफेशनल हंटर्स हां हां मैं करने जा रहा हूं हां हां वंस वी हैव 7 सी पॉइंट विल हैव नॉट टू डिफेंड ourselves हां हां साइड वी गेट आवर एक्सप्लोरर्स टू हील गेट ब्लैंकेट फिल्टर्स And up next is imperial, imperial bureaucracy. people on food keep six there tayar once the 300 comes in from diplomatic entry can we get the discount we can go with ottoman allies for super cheap oh, and we need some more houses makan banane wa makan banana kadara मैं करूंगा तैयार आदेश लकड़हारा ओके दिस इज लुकिंग गुड सो फार नाउ आई जस्ट नीड टू साइड Bide my time. Get up an edge. Let's get our racks out. We're gonna need one. Yeah. And we're aging with the Taj Mahal. Huh? Kamani wala? Kamani wala? Adesh. हाँ, 
Sight. As he's fortress now. Let's take away his eyes. Yeah, we kind of knew he was going to be going for a Fortress Age thing, so that's no surprise. Huh? Actually, let's come up here. It's much safer up there. There's discipline, sepoys. We're gonna save our shipment until age four. On the ground is 800 coin that we need for age up. We have quite a bit of extra line of sight. It's pretty much all around. Hello. Yeah. Uh, that'll be crowded pretty soon, so let's go down here. Hello. <sighs> and now we're gonna get ready to go up to the final one. Dominar game. Now we're going to start training Sepoy. And building houses. He just kind of let me do this. I think it's because he's scared of the score lead. Oh, okay. It's game time. Right, we're gonna need a new racks, that's fine. 14 C point. Don't go over there. Don't go over there, Jesus Christ! Oh, this is where the real game begins. So we need an honored sepoy upgrade. That's where his military isn't. There, now we fight. We have honored sepoys now.
Alright, next we get the Mansubdar Yabrumi. Adish, Kamane Wala. And he's wives. Adesh. Makan banana. Makan banana wala. Makan banana lakadara. Adesh so now we push. He's not totally right. But he has lost a good chunk of his forces. And these men, these roomies should just shred him. Yeah, or Yurumi just shred heavy infantry. That was just bound to happen. Oh, I need a new consulate. That's right. I forgot about that. Let's see here, we need food. Let's just get rid of this so we can ship more of these. Yeah, he's trying to make more artillery foundries. A boy, fucking India fast industrial. I mean, I, he didn't have coffee milk guns. I think he was just, he, he just shipped some Gatlings for the push and then made a couple. I don't think he sent the coffee milk guns card. Or if he did, the Mansadars just kind of shit all over it. All right. I love a good India fast industrial, especially when it works well. It works especially well against fast fortresses, I find, but especially fast fortresses that let me get to the industrial age. Uh, if it's a fast fortress that- if it's like a really quick fast fortress that hits at like the 9-10 minute mark, I'm fucked. But if it's a rush, I can handle it because you can combine uh, seven sentinels plus your aggro plus uh, Sentries and Irregulars plus the Ottoman Minutemen tech, and like nobody can push into that. Uh, at least not with like a, an all-in rush. If it's a sustained rush that lasts a, li a bit longer, you're, uh, it's a little bit tougher. Um, but if it's and if it's a, a fast fortress that hits at like the nine ten minute mark, that's like where the strategy is at its weakest. You know, uh, so things like pure Shiki will really have a potential to fuck the strategy up. Because that hits up, like, the perfect time, 
you know. Granted, there's a lot of infrastructure they have to burn through before they make serious progress, but um, it definitely is one of the bigger threats. However, if it's a push that is kind of uh, based around the idea of fast fortressing and then kind of booming just a little bit, you know, before making a big push at around the 10, 11 minute mark, like this USA player did, uh, this, this strategy just kind of shits on that. I just kind of left them into my base for a little bit, uh, lead them in while I build up my stuff, and then bam, wham, bam, honored units all at once. And that's how it rolls. Yeah, let's look at, uh... Yeah, I had, I had resources. I, I had more resources than just about everything except food, it looks like. Forty-six for units. Now, honored Sepoy versus Veteran Regulars. 300 HP and 41 attack. Oh, wait, he doesn't have a single regular on the field for me to compare to. I killed them all. <laughs> I mean, he had nothing. Nothing. How many villagers did I lose? I lost quite a few. 39 down to 37, so 2 here, and then 3 here, so that's 7, 8, 9, 10. I lost 10 settlers throughout this fight. I mean, he kept me pretty well locked up, but... For a little bit I was food starved because I had run out of hunts up here and I just needed to take the risk and bite the bullet and gather from down here while well, his army was here. Not not ideal, but had to be done. Thank you, gentles and ladymen, for watching the video. Please do consider subscribing or leaving a like or a comment. It really helps the channel grow uh, so I can do more of this stuff. Thanks again. Have a good day.